Hey guys, Saint 8 here. Now, we're gonna have a little a little special run here on Nuclear Throne because this is being recorded on Christmas. Yay, clap, 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 clap. So, with that being said, uh, I already have the little bit of festive uh, side art going on with the uh, YV side art, which is seven out of eight. And I got a circular crosshair for like Christmas wreaths and stuff, but if you don't celebrate Christmas, happy holidays, congratulations. I have you guys in, in there as well. But it is Christmas time, which means there's a little bit of special stuff going on, and I want to try a little special build. Now, you might notice I already have Robot's Bee skin. That's because I already tried recording this once, but uh, didn't vibe with it. Also notice, there's snow now. That's because it's Christmas, and, you know, festives, and all that fun stuff. But anyways, uh, we're using Robot's Bee skin. And we're using a golden grenade launcher. Uh, let me give you a moment to to take in what robot does real quick. And uh, wha bam! Hey guys, editing Saint Eight here. Just to tell you, robots' passive is that they get better technology, which means they get better weapons. Uh, two difficulties higher than usual, which is why I have a heavy crossbow and a laser rifle right here. Um, their active is they can eat their weapons they're currently holding for either ammo or uh, or ammo drops, or <laughs> ammo or ammo drop, ammo or health drops. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and just get back to the video after I show you uh, me eating this heavy crossbow. Just like that. Anyways, back to the video. Alrighty, now that you know what, uh, what Robot does, let's go ahead and hop right in here. I'm gonna throw that little explanation there just in case anyone wants it. Double grenade launcher, don't need it. I'm gonna get rid of that cactus just in case. So, what kind of special run am I going for? We're going to need a lot of weapon mutations. You might know, you might not know, but hopefully I can pull it off. Especially with, uh... Especially with Robot here. Also, I did a little manipulation there, a little, little min-maxing. I killed that bandit, but since the rad canister counts as an enemy, I blew that up, and that's why the portal spawned on the rad canister and not on this bandit up here. We mutated, uh, we mutated, which is, which is pretty good. Uh, lay the ring, because we need weapon mutations. We need weapon mutations. Sledgehammer is nice. Now I have a close range option. I'm gonna take a random ammo here instead of uh, three grenades. That way I can get the uh, the full extent of, of that ammo chest there. A laser pistol would be nice. Also, that's a lot of maggots over there. Alright, took another random ammo again. One tap big bandit by using the uh, multi-hit glitch with uh, melee weapons. Now, I can be thorough with all of these maggots. That's a lot of weapons on the ground. This might just be... A, a fifth mutation, perhaps? Maybe? I don't know. Look at all those weapon drops. Jesus Christ. Okay, what do we want here? Hmm... I think... I'm going to take the SMG. I'm going to take the SMG with me, I think. No. No, actually, I'm not. So, I'm going to eat that. Eat that. Eat that. And... Eat that. I'm going to keep this. This is the loadout I want to keep. Uh, Throne Butt is good. Bowling Veins does count. 
for the uh, for the thing I'm trying to do. But shotgun short boiling veins. We need boiling veins in this current situation. Okay, so remember whenever I said these guys might be loop exclusive? They're not. They're just a rare spawn for the alligator dudes. But that's for uh, anyone who, who caught that. Congratulations. Nice. Thanks for fact checking me. I greatly appreciate it because I completely forgot that they're not loop exclusive. Alright, uh, that. We have two slow weapons, one of which being explosive, so we have to be careful here. We have to be methodical. There's the gift chest, uh, down there. Is that everyone? It was. Right, I'm gonna ricochet that off the wall so we can be accurate. Get our weapons as well. Also, fun fact, this weapon right here that went through this portal, even if we go through this portal down here, that weapon will still come with us. I would prefer second stomach or trigger fingers here, but we have to do the funny. And it was a shotgun anyways. Actually, I'm going to take the shotgun with me. Because we have shotgun shoulders. And it'll be funny. Alrighty, a uh, heavy crossbow. No. Get some energy out of that, I guess. Did we get the rad canister? I think we did at some point. Perhaps. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, we did. It's right there next to the gift chest. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Mad cute. Yum yum. <laughs> Gotta be careful here. Gotta be methodical because look at all those enemies. Oh. And we get the weapon chest and we leveled up as well. Okay, so this right here, this is why I was taking uh, those those weapon mutations. If you have three weapon mutations, three or more, uh, you have a chance to get Heavy Heart as a mutation, which means more weapon drops. It is overall uh, just mediocre in my opinion, but this is the funny. This is what I wanted. This right here. More weapon drops on, on ye old robot. Super Splinter Gun. Super Splinter Gun is neat. But more weapon drops is cool. Pretty neat. Pretty neat indeed. So now we have to go to, uh, to the Crown Vault. All will become clear momentarily. Uh, I should probably go ahead and eat this. Yeah. Get two shells out of it. We gotta be careful here. Two snipers is not good for us. Okay, so... I need to get these crows up here. Trying to think on how I'm gonna do that. Pop rifle is neat. I don't think we're gonna be able to take this crown vault. I think we have to take the uh, the frozen wasteland crown vault. Hmm. Because I don't see these guys coming up here anytime soon. Yum yum yum. 
Mm, that was enough there. All right, come on, you bastard. Fly over here, please. I beg of you. That's not flying. Actually, I can just kite them around like a bandit. Come here. Where are you? Bandit time. Come on. I forgot, they share the same AI as bandits, just with an extra move. Yeah, I wasn't able to get it. I gotta take the frozen wasteland one. Damn it. That's sad. You might already know what I'm referring to whenever I'm talking about this. However, if you don't, you'll be pleasantly su uh, surprised. Big dog, big dog is dead. Big dog no longer alive. Rip him. He served his purpose, I guess. Okay. Now, instead of a normal shotgun, I'm gonna go ahead and take the sawn off with me. And this hyper rifle uh, went through the portal. So, I think it's time we get rid of the sledgehammer. Goodbye, sledgehammer. You were useful. Now, Sawnoff's gonna put in work because we have, uh, shotgun shoulders. Shotgun shoulders is really good for this weapon because it is, in fact, believe it or not, a shotgun. Okay, I'm gonna clear out this left area first. There's some stuff over here I want to look at. Like the blood launcher. Am I taking it? No. But, you know, it was nice to consider it. Nothing in that corridor there. Is there a thing on the ground? Also, ow. Rude. I thought I saw something on the ground. Oh well. It is what it is. Alright, what do we want to take here? What would be funny? Back muscle would be cool. Uh, open mind would also be cool. But I think I think we need back muscle. I think back muscle with how much ammo we're getting is just a good grab. Killed him with shotgun shoulders. Hog. Point blank you. Okay. What do we want? There was a weapon back here, right? Yeah, the lightning shotgun. Uh, no. Even though we do have energy, or er, laser brain, we do not want that particularly. Now, a laser minigun, on the other hand. Hmm. And I just saw an auto shotgun go through there. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to eat the hyper rifle. Keep the laser minigun. I, I lost that ammo chest, but it is what it is. And we're going to take the auto shotgun. All right, portal's activated, so we have a, uh, an arena-wide, uh, whatchamacallit, plutonium hunger, which is pretty cool. Uh, lightning cannon. No. Super bazooka. No. However, that was cool. Bouncer SMG. 
No. Yeah, I think this is the loadout I want to keep. Alrighty. Now, crown vault time. And for the main reason why I wanted to do this. You also got second stomach. Second stomach is cool. I like second stomach. But, it is time for the funny. Here's why I wanted to do this run. No ammo drops, more weapon drops. We already have more weapon drops, but now we have even more weapon drops. Jump, you bastard. Get up here. There you go. Hmm. Yum, yum, yum. Now we have variety. Variety is the spice of life. Energy hammer? Hmm. Big think. No. Uh, jackhammer? For the same reason I'm not taking energy hammer right now? No. Get out of here. And, and that reason was because I didn't have, uh... I didn't have long arms, was, was the reason. Grenade shotgun, though. I could dig with it. Yes. And we have, we have, uh, bowling vans as well, so we're still safe while we use it. Here's lightning rifle as well. Let's sniper rifle. We got a sniper rifle here now. I'm not gonna take it though. Eat that. Eat that. Wish we had a grenade rifle. Ooh, an eraser. Yeah, I'm taking that. Because we have shotgun shoulders, and that is cool. Uh, take this. Eat that. There's a car guy up there. He needs to die. And again, I just pulled out the same thing with the, uh, with the rad canister, where I shot it to make it look like an enemy, or the game perceive it as an enemy. Any other weapons down here? No. All right, it is time for the fun. Or time for the fun. Laser cannon. Shotgun, flare gun. Eat that. Eat that. Still got the eraser. What is that? Splinter pistol. Eat that. Triple machine gun. Surprise. In my gullet now. Uh, flamethrower. Surprise. You are now food for the laser minigun. Heavy slugger. Surprise. You're now what? You're you're now food as well. Do I want efficiency? I want efficiency, because that's three, uh, that's three ammo for five lasers. I'm gonna do something wild here. I'm gonna eat that. Got you, bazooka. No, 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 because I need to eat you. There we go. Alrighty. The correct answer is trigger fingers here. Alright, I want those reds. Mm -hmm. 
Got to focus on dodging here. We got to keep in mind, our difficulty right now is, like, pretty up there, I think. Actually, no, I think it's just one more difficulty than usual. Hum, hum, hum. Blood hammer. No. Lightning hand or lightning pistol. No. You no. You no. Hum hum hum. What to do? What to do? We got the funny. We don't have rabbit paw, which would make it even funnier. But it's still good enough. There was a machine gun in there somewhere, apparently. And another hyper rifle. Hmm. Dog. Swap this out for the incinerator for a moment. Because that is, in fact, affected by, uh... By, whatchamacallit, shotgun shoulders. Because they are considered, uh, pellets. What do I want to take with me? A laser cannon, I think. I think this is the loadout I still want to go with. So, eat that. Use that just to open that up a little bit. Oh, what is this? A super crossbow, auto flame, plasma cannon. We have trigger fingers. We have trigger fingers. So. I'm going to eat this. Eat this. Eat this. Alright. Grab this for random ammo. I'm going to do something wild. I'm going to eat the eraser. I know, wild. This is the loadout we're going with, which is still very weird. Super crossbow and a blood hammer. Um, fun fact here, let me just show off what happens if you eat a cursed weapon. You go all the way down to 1 HP. Just figured I'd show that off, especially since we had another weapon laying there that we weren't going to use. To, to get some health back. I took damage for your amusement. I hope you're happy. I hope you're happy. Alrighty, throne time. You. That's a devastator right there. We live. Surprisingly. We also ultra mutated as well. Which is pretty cool. And there's no weapons down there to, to bring with me, I forgot. Okay, high tier weapons only. Auto eat weapons left behind. Eating weapons can drop chests. Auto eat weapons left behind. High tier weapons only.
There we go. Problemo solve mode. Now we have to be careful. Or do we? Surprise! We have trigger fingers. I gotta keep that in mind. Yum yum yum. Yum yum yum. What to eat? What to eat? Right, you for energy. You for bullets. Just shot that off just because I can. I gotta be careful not to eat what I wanna keep. Hmm. Yum yum yum. Okay, you. Eat you. I think I'm gonna keep lightning cannon. So I'm gonna eat that for bullets. Same here. Oh, that's a golden bazooka right there. Oh wow. Eat you for a bunch of bullets. That's a lot of gold weapons. That's like a shocking amount of gold weapons. And all of these, I'm going to auto-eat. An auto-crossbow. We don't have bolt marrow, sadly. Look at that. Full ammo. Immediately. Going crossbow, going shotgun. Guns for breakfast, he says. Guns for breakfast. Double minigun, hyper rifle, blood launcher. Okay, now. Now, we have a choice. We have a choice. We can get rid of our crown for no ammo drops. But for more weapon drops. And use crown of blood, or we can keep this. Here's what I think. A laser minigun. I'm gonna eat it. Alrighty. It's time for the fun. Jeez, I want Big Bandit to spawn in an area that is manageable, please. That is not manageable. Dodge you. Pain? Also, I don't have strong spirit. Oop, boop. See daisies. Ammo? Wow, look at that. Actual ammo drops? In this economy? Ultra grenade launcher. Hmm. That'll be good, actually. Like, legitimately good for us. We're not going to be able to get rid of it if we ever need to, but it's good for us. Do I want to keep this as my spam weapon? As my close range spam weapon just in case shit hits the fan? Yes. Yes, I do. Let me eat this, though, real quick. Get some more bullets, and then auto-eat everything. Okay, Ultra Grenade Launcher is good here. This is not a good spawn. You 
guys. Be careful here. I'm gonna die here if I'm not careful. God damn it, I died to a rat. I saw him last second. Shit. Ah, damn it. Oh well. That was that was a fun little build. And we can do it right off the bat, sorta. Because we're able to spawn in with uh with the crown. So anyways, if you guys like that video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you guys L-A-T-E-R. Later.